about that action. Time to put in work, finally. Um, so, since the heel injury, I was just maintaining, just like doing workouts, whatever I could, some weightlifting, some jumps, whatever I could, just, just rehab IRs type stuff. Finally got to the day where I did the backboard dunks, so I was able to jump pretty hard off my right left, even though I didn't plant fully on the heel, I was able to get some explosive jumps and jump hard. So, that was like my first official day back jumping, I guess, off the right left. So as to be expected, I jumped low the next time, which was Sunday. I did have like two full days of a lot of activity where I drained my body, so I was didn't have that much energy. But I knew I would have a low day, so I kind of forced it that day, even though it wasn't a great performance. I'm glad to get that out of the way. So yesterday, which is the day I worked out, which is what this video is, is my workout, which felt great. I just really wanted to get a heavy lift in, because I know I'm going to be able to jump a lot the next time I go out, so I know I need to get back into my full routine. So I think yesterday, which today, this video, official day back into the full routine. Even though my heel is still like 90%, I can't, it still hurts a tad, I still think I can get a full jump workout in and a full dunk session, so that's why I feel like I'm fully back, even if I can't do it. If I just do all backboard dunks, that's fine. It's still working on my vertical. Not so much the dunk tricks, but at least I'm jumping and doing my vertical. So today, hello, hello. After I did those workouts, I felt super loose. Whenever I do heavy lifting, I feel really loose. My flexibility is improving, I think, but I really need to get on some kind of stretch program or like a really good routine because it's hard to measure how flexible I'm getting. I feel looser than I ever have in my life after I do those heavy workouts, I think, because it really pushes me into those positions. So I need to uh, document that as well because flexibility has been like the last key part besides getting healthy. Flexibility has been the one part that I've struggled with a lot, so I want to show that how bad I am at flexibility, I want to be a really flexible person. I'm definitely a person who has had bad, bad, the worst flexibility you could have. So if I can get to a really flexible point, uh, that will be a great thing to show how I did it. So right now I'm just stretching a lot, but I'm going to try to look into it a little bit more. So I felt really good working out, lifted heavy. Um, just did a lot of legs and then today I kind of feel like hooping a little bit just to break a sweat just because um, I haven't played in a while. I just really want to but I'm gonna keep it super short and I'm really excited for tomorrow. I'm gonna go dunking, um, hopefully an empty gym. I found one that's pretty empty usually around the time I go. So I'm really looking forward to that. Looking forward to some more dunks and definitely looking forward to getting like a lot of jumps going and then my heel, we'll see how it does feels okay so if I can jump off backboard and that's all I can do you'll see a million of those so I'm sorry about that but as soon as it's healed it's back to going crazy I'm going crazy but we're back so that's it